I want to show people, listen, Ali, I want to quickly show people there's another part of Texas uh, where you can see that's also live in, in Austin, I believe. You can see how light, it's, uh, you can't see right now probably, Ali, but it is so bright and daylight in Austin, let alone where you are in Del Rio, it's pitch black. It's still hard to wrap your mind around. Yeah. Like you always hear the energy feels a little different when this happens. Like, I, I mean, I look actually, wow, look, it's coming, the sun's coming back now all of a sudden. That's crazy. There we go. Now we're back in daytime hours, Brian. How wild is this? Sun is coming back out. There's actually a break in the clouds right now, a rare break. So everyone's got their glasses back on. Let's see, we gotta, we gotta join in the party, right? We can't, we gotta partake. I got the ones that you don't throw away, man, come on. So this is real, wow. How cool is this? I mean, you guys at home, I really hope that you're somewhere that you get to see uh, some of this phenomenon because it really is something that millions of Americans are experiencing right now together, something that's bringing us together, right? We know our nation is pretty divided right now, but what a cool thing to come together in one place and experience the same phenomenon and to be brought together by that. Just so cool. And again, we don't get to see this for another 20 years, as you've been saying, Brian. So here we go. We got the sun coming back up. We got normal life again here in Del Rio after a historic monumental time here, one of the first places in the United States to actually experience totality for this solar eclipse in 2024. What a cool thing, Brian. What a cool thing to be a part of today. Wow, first place in America, and you are there, Ali Bradley, and it went from dark, and now the sun is coming up again in Del Rio. That is so awesome. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider, and don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.